Welcome back. Well, first they beat the reigning 2A state champs in the preseason. Then they took down the 5A Arnold Marlins, and now they're looking to the 4A Mariana Bulldogs. News 13's Emma Stamps has more on the small but mighty Blentstown Tigers. We really ain't scared of nobody. It don't matter how big you are, how fast you are, we'll go up against anybody. The talent in Blentstown has not gone unnoticed. The AP Florida Class 1A state rankings for week three rank the Tigers at number four. Half of us here don't even have internet at home, and uh, we don't pay attention to that kind of stuff. I mean, look, it, it's, it's flattering and all that kind of stuff, but the same poll, if we lose this Friday, I have a side in the top ten. Uh, we're just trying to play our best ball. If you're playing your best football come playoff time and you get in, uh, you got a chance. It's like going to the homecoming dance. You get in the door, you at least got a chance to dance with the prettiest girl there. This week, the Tigers will get to show their community what they're made of as they play their first home game since Hurricane Michael hit last October. Uh, it's just it's just the best feeling ever, to be honest with you. Like We're just so happy to play a home game, have all our fans show up, and all the family members and, our, and all our blood just show up, and it just means a lot and everything. No matter the rankings or record, Johnson said he wants to create great opportunities for his team to enjoy their time as high school football players. I just want to have fun and play for my brothers out here. That's about it. I don't really care about going to the next level to play. I just want to play for fun and play for my brothers. One son's game against Mariana will kick off at 7 on Friday night. Emma Stamps, New 13 Sports, Panhandle Strong.